Hi, I'm Lynn Richardson, and I have a few tips to help you get through this unprecedented time. First, don't worry. You can't do anything with worry. You can't do anything with fear. You can't do anything with doubt. Allow yourself to be in this space at this time and to flow. The world is in a situation that we've never ever seen before. And trust me, we all actually have to work together to get through this. So let's talk about your bills. Right now, the only thing you need to do is be aware. You are not obligated to pay anything right now. No one can be evicted. We can't be on a quarantine and then evict people. It wouldn't work. But what you should do is be responsible. Grab a sheet of paper or get an Excel spreadsheet. Write all of your bill collectors. Write everybody. Your rent, your mortgage, your light bill, your gas bill, your car note, your car insurance. Netflix, write all of your creditors in one column. In the next column, write the amount that you owe. Don't estimate. Go look at the bill, get online, grab your envelope, whatever it is, but you wanna be accurate. The next thing you wanna do in the next column is to record the due date. Now that you're armed with this information, you're gonna call each creditor one at a time. And you're gonna say you've been impacted by the pandemic. You need a temporary suspension of payments. What can you do for me? Now you're gonna be on the phone for quite some time because everybody, literally everybody in the world is calling. So be patient. Ask for the person's name, their ID number, and a phone extension if you can have one. Be sure you know exactly how much you are allowed not to pay and be sure you know the exact date when you are required to pay. Write that on your spreadsheet as well. Make sure you contact them one month before your next due date so you can be sure that your plan is still in place and that if you still need more time, you can request it then. Remember, we're all in this together. Contact all of your creditors, no matter how big or how small. Now during this time, don't spend any unnecessary money if you don't have to. We don't know when the stimulus checks are coming. We don't know how much it's going to cover. We don't know how much we're gonna need for resources, basic resources like food, hand sanitizer, and soap. So be frugal during this season. Stay home, get back connected with your children, learn a new skill, start a home-based business. Now is the best time to hit the reset button. And remember, you can't do anything with fear. You can only move forward with faith. So surrender, get equipped with the information you need, start calling, and I'll see you on the other side.